In a season where the Oilers reached new heights as a team, posting 50 wins, going 14-0-1, leading into the playoffs, all while experiencing plenty of personal milestones. McDavid set up by Drysaddle. Another breakaway. This time, he wins it. Connor McDavid, his 60th goal. Edmonton 4, Arizona 3. Overtime! As well as critical building blocks like both Matthias Ekholm and Nick Bukestad, it's no secret that the Oilers feel like they fell short this year. However, there is a consistent theme that is evident amongst this group. We're all here to win. Um, when you don't, it's, it's disappointing. But, um, you know, talk, talk about it within our group. And obviously we got to use that in, in a positive way and, and come back come back next season, make this, the, the changes we need to do, and um, yeah, it's a couple of bust. You know, I think in situations like um, us falling short this year, and that is what we did, we fell short of what our expectation internally was. Um, that's never uh, something fun to go through. Um, you know, I think Ken used the word devastated. I would echo that. Um, you know, I think you, know, you, you go through stages. The first one is feeling that way. Um, the next one is learning how to repurpose that disappointment. Um, and the way you do that is by learning some lessons and you use that experience to serve as your motivational fuel. Those are, are all part of the process of learning um, lessons along the way of gaining experiences, sometimes painful ones. Uh, but in the end, you hope the payoff is, is that if you continue to knock on the door, you continue to knock on the door um, and you learn some of those hard lessons, um, that one day that door opens. As oil country looks ahead to what's possible next season, Stuart Skinner is the prime example of how to use difficult circumstances as fuel moving forward. Is it true that you kept your broken stick from the LA? Yeah, uh, yeah, it is true. It's uh, in my basement right now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna find a spot on the wall to hang it up. It's a reminder, um, you know. It's a reminder that things, you know, it, it's life. Um, you know, all of us in this room have have experienced that. You know, things don't go well all the time. Uh, you're gonna get knocked down. Um, you know, if you watch R Rocky Balboa movies, it's not about how many times you get knocked down, right? It's about how many times you get back up. So. Um, you know, we've been down in series, you know, we've we've lost in the third round, lost in the second round. Uh, when I look at that stick, it shows me perseverance. It shows me that, you know, things aren't going to go well and it's and that's OK. And you're going to battle back from that. You're going to work back from that. You're going to get back up and, you know, keep fighting. And that's what this team does. Um, so it's a it's a reminder of, you know, of my teammates and how they persevere and also about how uh, how I battle back as well. For Oilers TV, I'm Paige Martin.